This is Taryn with Justice for Mom, and uh, thank you for being here with me on this beautiful day. So I wanted to talk to you about friends. So we all have them. They depend on us, and we depend on them, and they're there for us in good times and bad times. And so that's why I wanted to talk to you today about friends in relation to domestic abuse. As a friend, you're obviously closest to somebody. Out of the 7.7 .7 billion people on the planet, you're going to know that person 99.9999999% better than anybody else. So you're going to be pretty attuned to if there might be some domestic abuse occurring in their life. And so as a friend, that's the time when you don't want to close your eyes to that, but you want to help them get through that and be strong. I definitely know how shattering domestic abuse can be to the whole family. I was there when my father, Mike Rinder, attacked my mother and damaged her for life. And I've been with my mother in the hours after, the days, the months, and ever since. My father's domestic abuse and attack on my mother was so vivid and is so vivid, it's like a scar that never heals. Seeing the gouged flesh on my mom's arm, seeing the blood, seeing her in so much pain from this domestic abuse is something that makes it very hard to forget. I remember the moment of my mom graphically explaining to me what happened and saying, T, I heard my, I heard a bone crack. I heard something crack in my body when Mike Rinder had his hands on me and was attacking me. And that is why she's in so much pain. I was there when my mom learned that Mike Rinder actually cracked her shoulder and caused nerve damage that can never be fixed. The surgeons can't, can't fix it. Anyone who has had to experience domestic violence, such as the violence that my father, Mike Rinder, inflicted on my mother, needs help. And so I want to stress that you do anything you can to avoid that pain even happening before it's too late. From someone that has experienced the effects of domestic violence firsthand, I just want to make sure that you know how vital it is to actually look out for your friends. Talk to your friends. If you know of or even suspect domestic abuse, help them out, listen to what they have to say, console them. They might not want to talk about it and they might have a lot more pride than would allow them to say something, but you're going to know it. It's just a fact. Women have good instincts about these things. So trust your instincts, be there for them, support them, help them, and stand up for them. And together, we will rid this world of domestic abuse. Thank you. It's Taryn with Justice for Mom.